Hello everybody. <laughs> hey warriors, here we are. So yes. to all the troubled students who feel that, you know, sir, what if I do not clear my JE or is there any alternative without JE that I can enter into IIT? I don't think you should stop dreaming about IIT JE just because you are not IIT JE, just because you could not clear JE or you are not able to clear JE. Don't stop dreaming because IIT is still a possibility and which is why we are here. And as for the, you know, the topic says no J, no problem. So we're going to tell you without J, what are the things, what are the options that you have to go to IIT? Exactly. In for it, yeah. everybody. Go ahead, smash the like button because it's not just going to be one way yes. or two ways or three ways, but there, there are multiple, multiple ways. ways. And not just one IIT or two IITs, yes. but multiple many IITs. Multiple IITs, yes. Most of the old IITs especially yes. and as you know the old IITs are the one you can't really say that they hold more weightage but it's just a brag to say that you belong to one of the old IITs. And you'll get yeah. a degree exactly. with the IIT name on it. Absolutely. That's what you would want. And yes. you know the best part man I was reading about so many interviews by all the top CEOs. Hmm. They're like we don't care about you know if you are from this college or that college. Correct. Correct. We, it's the skills. Yeah, it's the skills. It's the skills. And you can get those skills, you can get those, you know, brand value, even if you do not get through J. So let's exactly. dive into it. Let's go ahead. Yes. So, okay. But before that, don't forget to subscribe to those students who are here for the first time. Do not forget to subscribe. It's a lot of effort, a yeah. lot of research that goes behind our class. So we need your subscribe. We need your support. Okay. Exactly. So now let's move on. I know it's a blank slide, but that's not what we're going to tell you. We are actually going to tell you about certain things. Let me change to the website, you know, and what we're going to do is we're going to actually present you with all the links through which you can go if you want to, you know, get into these courses. Okay. And, and I think the links, we will be also pasting it in the description box, which you will, you can see. Okay. okay. So the right. first way of entering into a IIT without J that is going to be for your BS course what is BS <laughs> <laughs> it sounds a little funny but it's not how it is it's actually BS in yes your your favorite mathematics teacher Shimon sir's own college IIT M that is IIT Madras yes so BS in, in data, data science. science exactly now, did you know that the starting salary for data science for freshers is, is almost 10 to 15 lakhs? And if you do not know, as, as Sir was telling me, that he act, he knows people who have gone to abroad just because of this. Data yes. science. Exactly. Data science. So, guys, the best part is, even if you are a mechanical engineer or any other engineer, if you develop these skill sets, if you have these certificates, you can enter into a computer science background. Absolutely. A lot of times students are like, sir, I did not get into IIT college. I got some other college, but I'm not even getting computer science. So you can take up a, a good college, but not so great branch and mm. not waste a year. And then yes. uh, get these skill sets, get these certifications and enter into a top notch technological company. Exactly. Like 10 years back, I, I don't know if, if you, how young you guys were. But 10 years back, did, did you know that uh, ONGC or oil companies, they were the soaring high, like everybody who used yeah. to work in oil, they were considered to be, oh my God, you yeah. know, you are the God, you have cracked your life. Correct. But today, if you talk about yeah. what is actually that God level ultra legendary job, it's this guys. Data it's science, this. machine learning. Data science, machine all learning, these things absolutely, are. yes. You know, all of these are the new age jobs that are going to fetch you the money that you dream for. Exactly. Yes. There are few more ways, number two and number three, but I'm not going to show it to you right now. Yes. First, let's look let's, into let's all look the into details. This. Let's yeah. look into this. We also have the links that we're going to show you. Yeah. So the first one is, let's let's talk about the IIT Madras degree program here. We Link go. will be there in the description box. Okay. You can simultaneously open yeah. it and see as we talk. Okay. So first good news everybody, first good news. Those of you who are in 11th, if you are thinking that th this session is not for you, guess what? You also are eligible my dear student and you can also apply for it. It's written right here that school students who have appeared for their class 11 final, if you have just appeared for class 11 finals, 
then this is also for you okay, okay. this is also for you great apart from that now, now there are multiple degrees in yes. this diplomas and other things i'll talk about it in a detail there is a very special thing about this course you might be like sir how many months is this how many years that's the best part about this course and that's what you're going to like okay and you know yes. uh, i think i missed it somewhere maybe here, here, yes here, here. Yeah. This yeah. certification also is awarded by Wharton University of Pennsylvania, guys. That's an amazing thing you are getting an international accreditation Correct. for your degree. Correct. Yes. Okay. Now, so let's on probably here, go to apply uh, now. Yes, yeah. Apply. Eligibility details. Yes. So I think we will just click on eligibility details. Yes. Yeah. So in the eligibility details, first of all, you have also a lot of important dates that you might want to check it out yes you should main thing you is should. the form closes on 10th, 10th of may. may yes that's few days so from you now. still have yeah. two months but just make sure that you apply for it uh, earlier the better yeah. as you know right so mandatory requirements guys access to good internet connection as well as laptop desktop device will be key requirement to learn effectively from our course for a complete list of software and hardware requirements please refer so whatever software and hardware that you need that is also given to you I think most you can just of you click on it fine. just click on it and you can watch it okay and uh, each huh. person might have to travel to some exam center because there are some quizzes imagine yes. you get to meet people who are into this course it's Sorry. kind of a hybrid course you know yes yes and there are examination cities you can just click on this link i'm not just opening it up for you you can yes. do that on your own so this is for the okay. exam centers right now right. this is very interesting okay so who can apply for admissions mm -hmm. very interesting Anyone who has passed class 12th or equivalent, irrespective of age or academic background, even a commerce student, even an art student can apply for this. Us too, irrespective yeah. of age. We too. If, may, maybe we will be your classmates. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> even you. students who are applied for class 11th final exam. So if you are 11th moving 12th student, you are still applicable irrespective of board, group, stream, huh. nothing. But okay. one thing is that, one thing, in your class 10th, if you have studied mathematics and English, that is expected of you, not mandatory, mandatory. however, but expected yeah. of you. It makes okay. sense, yeah, come on, data yeah. science, and so, plus the course will be taught in English, so correct. good thing, already yeah. you are on English channel. Exactly. And no other additional eligibility yes. other than these ones are mentioned, okay? Mentioned. Apart from that, while you are appearing for the exam, so, just like how you pay for your JE exam fees, right? Just the exam, not the semester and everything. So, for general category or OBC applicant, it's 3,000. As you can see, can you guys see? I hope yeah. you guys can see. Ha, okay. This is fine, I guess. Yeah. Hmm. So, 3,000 rupees, SCST, all, all of this is there. You know, you can just go it's through it. It's very reasonable, I mean. Yeah. Okay. In, okay. An additional exam facilitation fee will only apply for op people who are learning to write the a qualified exam. Now, what is this qualified exam? We'll come to it. Yeah. Okay. Welcome to Applications will be considered only after the payment is done. That is standard. Huh. Now you can see to enter this course, there are two ways. Two ways. One is J hmm. and second is regular entry. I'm not huh. talking about J because that is not what you're here for. Yeah. And you know, I mean, there are multiple, uh, you know, courses, multiple videos where everybody has told you how to get into J, how to get through J. So let's leave that. Let's talk about the regular entry, what we can do. Okay. okay. So let's go to the direct hmm. regular entry. Yes. All regular entry applicants must undergo the qualifier process. So, yes. see, eligibility is there for everyone. But huh. there is a qualifying examination. But exactly. don't worry, it is not JE level. It is very simple. And yeah. the criteria is also very lenient. We'll see exactly. that. Exactly. Huh. Okay. So, it includes hmm. four weeks of coursework based on lecture videos, assignments, and live sessions. Hmm. English, maths for data science, statistics, and computational thinking. So, all the video lecture resources will be provided to you. Exactly. And based on that only, you are going to have the qualifier exam after Correct. four weeks. Hmm. Yeah. So, they are basically giving you four weeks. That is one month for you to prepare for the qualifier exam. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I think that's a great uh, initiative. There is minimum percentage also. Huh. So, minimum percentage is also there. Eligibility to appear for the qualifier exam. What is the eligibility for you to be able to appear for it? Okay. It's different that you can apply for it. Then it comes that if you can take the exam or not. Okay. So there are two steps. Now in each course, the average of the best two out of the first three assignment scores will be calculated. So you're giving three assignment out of that best wow. of the two will be taken. That's very okay? lenient. Very lenient. 
only those who get the minimum required average assignment scores in all four courses as given below will be allowed okay okay now as you see these are here. for general learner 40 percent for all the other categories also it's mentioned here okay 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 so only learners who are eligible okay so they will get the hall ticket details and yeah, yeah. all the other details are mentioned over here hmm. now the even the results are valid for quite some time in fact one year one year so yes. even if you're 11 student and you're giving the exam right now it's okay after one year you can chill and you know hmm. you have bs uh, certification probably <laughs> which you can do yes okay so there will be limitation on the number of courses which a learner is allowed because that's obvious because you cannot just enter into multiple courses. Yes. And okay. you can also take a retest, re-attempt, wow. but uh, for that also I think there is something written here. Yeah, re-attempt fees are there huh. and uh, it will be eligible for re-attempt the qualifier exam in the same term. Okay, huh. who are eligible? Okay, great, great. Same thing, same. almost same. I think okay, so. J-based entry, I'm giving it a miss because... Huh. Most of you. I think if you if you want, you can just read through it. Read through it. And international students, those who are not in India, there are certain countries like UAE, Sri Lanka, Bahrain, Kuwait, and Oman. You can also, you know, appear for this exam, and you can also be a part of this program. That's great. And till now, I think uh, one sixty odd uh, students from uh, other countries. Yes, yes from uh, one fifty nine. Yes. From other countries have enrolled in in this uh, you know course altogether. Only from outside, not from India. From India, we don't know the many number. It's, it's many. From international, we are talking about this. Now, apart from that, what the, else do we have? This one, academics. Huh. Yes. So now this is the best part about this program, which you're going to see. So Correct. there is a beautiful Amazing. flow chart that they have mentioned shown hmm. over here. So yes. I think let's just zoom, zoom it a little bit. Huh. Yeah. So once you enter apply. Yes, regular entry apply, as in without the JE, what will happen is, you will have your qualifier assignments and exam all of Four this. Weeks. Now you go to foundation level. Yes? Now this foundation level has 32 credits. Credits are basically points, you can say, uh, which is awarded to every participant or the student. Mm -hmm. And let's say, this is going to be for one year. You know? mm -hmm. And after that, I decide that I don't want to continue. Mm -hmm. No problem, you leave it. You will get a foundation certificate for, with IIT Madras written on it. That's yes. the best part. Yes. Within one year, you can leave. Okay. So that yes. is 32 credits. Yes. Then you can also do the diploma level. That's for another second year. Okay. If you do that, this is assigned 54 credits. And this time also, let's say after two years, you feel like, I eh, don't want to do it. You want to give it up. You want to, you know, you know, you want to pursue something else. Here also you will get a certificate, but this time your certificate will be written Diploma in Programming or Diploma in Data Science That's based great. on whatever you have chosen, okay? Very All nice. right, and once again, IIT Madras will be written there. So you are still considered to be an IITian. Third year, if you do the degree level certificate, you get 28 more grades and now you exit with a BSc yes. degree, imagine. Yes. In programming and data science and this is not even all this is and pro data science that's crazy yes. guys yes so are, are you understanding i hope you are clear with it firstly it is it is your uh, this thing, foundation then comes diploma then this is your degree and finally once you have completed all four the years. four years then you will ca you can exit with bs degree in data science and application and okay? the best part is i think they can do it even if you're enrolled in any other stream. any other course so, any and other it won't take you much time exactly. because it's yes. a very very easy peasy course it yes. will be convenient for your time exactly okay now, now here is your yeah. term structure like how every year is divided into three terms of four months like usually you have a first semester and second semester yeah, in, they in have colleges. Trimesters. You have trimesters. Yes, yeah. you have three semesters in one year. Okay. All right. Uh, then the, all the details all are mentioned. Details you check it out, guys. Huh. Now, mainly they have given about how this uh, terms hmm. will be assessed, how the assignments are assessed. Hmm. Examination cities are cities. also mentioned. Even the international cities are mentioned, mentioned where you can go and take the exam if you yeah. are an international student. Even map and is given. fee structure this is, is also very here. Important. Yes, yeah. This is important. So if you just, let's say for example, you do the course only for one year. Hmm. Okay. So then you have to pay only 32,000 32, rupees. If you do it for two years, 94,000. Three years, 1,57,000. BSc or BS degree, accordingly they have mentioned. Okay. This is hmm. the range of the 
fees. Yes. So you pay as much as you learn. So that's the best part, guys. You can choose. Tomorrow, if some new course comes somewhere else after two years, you will be like, okay, I want to finish. And not diploma. only that, hmm. fee waivers are also done. Oh, uh, right. It's also done there also. So See, if your income is more than 5 lakhs five or lakh, less than 1 lakh, accordingly. Then of course, you will have to pay the full fee. If it is 1 lakh to 5 lakh in 50 between, that 50% your fees is waived. And if it is, if less, it than is less than 1 LTA, then 75% of the fees is is taken off. And okay? it is even higher if you are into the category of OBC yes. or SCST, mm -hmm. guys. This is very good opportunity for everyone at very affordable fees. Mm -hmm. uh, fees and that to a degree from IIT, guys. Crazy. Yes. Okay. Now, do you think that oh, we are going to talk about only IIT Madras? Yes. <laughs> Obviously no. not. So other details are mentioned, other guys. You can just also. check it out all these page. Uh, we will details. be, uh, yeah. I mean, this link will be there in the description box. You can read through all of it. Now let's talk about other IITs. I'm also very excited. Let's let's talk about yeah, it. Yeah, so guys, yes. you can guess it obviously in the chat or in the comments. So the next one, very exciting, is drone, drone technology. My God. I mean, I come on. Most sure. of you are probably most of you have probably asked your parents that if I clear JE, if mm -hmm. I get 99% in boards, please do get me a drone, isn't it? Yeah. Now guess what? IIT Kanpur is providing you with a certificate course in drone technology. Isn't yes. it exciting? And I'll tell you what, IIT Kanpur is the only IIT which has an airstrip inside their campus. Whoa! Yeah. And yes. the students who get enrolled into aerospace engineering, mm -hmm. irrespective of which IIT they are, they have to compulsorily come to IIT Kanpur, IIT Kanpur for, you know, some labs and some experiments. Yes. So, you know, you'll be getting to visit that IIT, it's Correct. drone technology. Correct. And now, since we are not logged in and all of mm -hmm. that, so not much of not details much are Not much of details are yeah. there. Yeah. So, you basically just have to log in or register, whatever you choose to do. Do that, I think you will be able to read all the details here. But drone technology, I... Uh, it sounds very exciting. I feel like doing I it. I feel like doing it. Yes. Seriously. I, I really am very excited to just look at it and, uh, you know, get and into the this. the best part about this page is there are many online, online courses, courses for all of you guys. And many of the courses are free of course. Some of them are chargeable, but it is not too much. I mean, look at yes. it, 4,000, 5,000 rupees. Introduction so, to artificial intelligence, everything. All of these, AutoCAD, 2D. Yeah. And you get a degree is... again, or not yeah. a degree, a certificate. From IIT Kanpur. That's the best part, yes. okay? So many things are there, guys. I mean, MATLAB, everything, almost. AWS. I mean, these are the skills that you need it for a job, okay? That you yeah. need for a job. Seriously. This Too is, good. This is the outside world that they are trying to show you. AWS, this, the AWS server is used extensively in almost every company, right? Uh, this, this is how the certificate, certificate will look. looks like. Yes, See, this is IIT Kanpur name will come. And yes. the department, the academy, mm -hmm. and your name, everything. I mean, you can always boast about this yeah, That you have done this. That you have done this. Exactly. And uh, last but not the least, yes, we also have another course that you can go for. Okay. So let's talk about this. This is your undergraduate common entrance exam for design. Design. Yes. So if you are that person who has to hide your <laughs> sketchbook or drawing book just below your actual study book, then this is definitely for you. Pretty sure there's a lot of creative people <laughs> I'm here. sure. If design is something that you look up to, then this is something for you. The link is again there in the description yes. box, guys. Hmm. Okay, so the most important thing is that, the best part, the applications have just opened up depending on when you're watching this video and it will close on 31st, 31st of March. March. You still have time, okay? And the best part is, IIT Bombay, IIT Delhi, IIT Guwahati, okay, IIT so Hyderabad, IIT Hyderabad, and IIT D Jabalpur, Design, huh? D uh, DMJ, J I think, yeah. yeah, I think it is DMJ. Jabalpur, if I'm not wrong, yeah, Jaipur, yes. yeah, so, no, Jabalpur, sorry. Jabalpur, yes, ah. so all these IITs are participating in this, hmm. and you will get a certificate or degree from these institutes, it's a, it's a degree, BDES, B -des. it's a degree, B -des. it's not yes. just a certificate course, it's a degree, yeah. BDES, so yes, here also you do not require JE and you can be an IIT and, and get, look at this. What is this? IIT Bombay, Bombay. IIT Delhi, yeah. IIT Guwahati, IIT Hyderabad. All of these are the old IITs, my dear student, or old IIT, uh, old IITs. Okay, so you basically, if you are clearing your JE, then you know what are the ranks you require to get here. Now without JE, you can get here exactly. with this. So 
So here you see the application for hmm. these uh, institutes. Just you can just here. click on this. Hmm. You will be able to see the eligibility criteria. It is not very serious. Hmm. It is very, very lenient, guys. How hmm. many seats are there? What are the different procedures? Now it's a big document. This right? you will have to read it. 35 pages. We yeah. can't read it now. Sorry, guys. <laughs> yeah. So everything is there over here. So main thing is you click on important dates. Huh. Go down. Okay, and just click on admission schedule for B design program. Yes. yes. Now here we'll you will see the these. last date is 31st March. Hmm. Allotment starts in April. My yes. God, even before your um, you know J advance or bedside exam is over, you can confirm your seat. Hmm. First round is starting so early, and by June that's it. Final round. It's it's done. So just check it out if you haven't yet, and uh, I hope you I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope that uh, you all found it interesting that how without J, how can you go? Yes. So, so to summarize, one is your data science course from IIT Madras. The second one is IIT Kanpur. The main course is the drone, drone course, but there are many online courses, many of them. Okay. Yes. And the third one is basically your UC. I hope I did not miss any E's over there. Now, <laughs> Let's just say that even after all of these, even after all of these, this was not, you are not interested in this, you are not interested in this, you are not interested in this. What then? What then? You couldn't clear J. Does life stop here? Do you think that your dream of going to IIT has stopped there? No. Guess what? Even after doing your B.Tech or B.Sc, a graduation degree, guess what? You can still get into IIT. How? Number one, you have JAM test, joint admission test for masters, MSc or MTech. Okay. Next, next, what can you do? You can, if you are a commerce student or if you are a humanities student, there are multiple IITs, especially the old IITs after the new education policy, 2020-20, only, no? Anything? Yes, yes. Yes. So after the new education policy, they were strictly told that they have to have courses apart from science as well. So these old IITs, they also have courses on MA, uh, interdisciplinary fields, a lot of them. MA, MA, what was it? Liberal Arts. Liberal Arts. Yes. Yep. Then there are also a lot of other courses that you can check it out. Not only that. There is also, apart from JAM, you also have GATE, as Sir has written. Gate. By clearing gate also, you can go for PhD, you can go for MTech, you can go for an MTech PhD integrated course. Yes. And gate will also allow you to go for uh, IISC. Yes. IISC is also yes. there. So these are all the options that you have. So my dear students, just know that life doesn't stop after J. It doesn't. Okay. Now over to Sir. I'm pretty sure that he also has a lot of things to say. So guys, uh, remember that, you know, uh, just like ma'am has actually put it, your dream never ends, okay? It probably becomes even better and even larger. Yes. So don't be disappointed if you did not score well in J. We have given you all the alternatives. Even if you are not able to do these degree courses for some reason, now you can still do it after your B.Tech program. And who knows, you might even do a, be uh, you know, a better course maybe in some foreign university as well. Exactly. The point being is the awareness. And this is very important, guys. Many of your friends, your cousins, your relatives, they do not know how they can enter into IIT. They only know J. So I feel that you should spread this message to each and every Absolutely. friend, your classmate. Because, you know, it's not like the seats are limited in most of these courses. Most of them are recorded or, uh, you know, uh, free courses, I would say. So many students can take the advantage of these courses. Mm. So spread the message. Let everybody know how you can get the tag name of IIT even without J. That's exactly. what I feel you should exactly. do. I mean, you still have time. Give it all your best. But if not, if not, don't be disappointed. Don't yes. be disheartened. Life is a lot more than just one exam. Exactly. Yes? Just, let, let, just telling you a reality check. Don't think that this is where life stops. Just because your parents might have said something, just because some relatives might have, you know, provided you with some taunts, it's okay. It's okay. You still have four to five years to shine a light on yourself and show them that, hey, this was your taunt, but I'm giving it back to you. Yeah? So don't worry about it. 
and uh, like share and subscribe <laughs> yeah leave in the comments how you enjoyed the session and yes. if you have anything else to ask you know you can always put it down in the comments our lovely community members subscribers will also try to answer this thank you and, so and much and if you want more career counseling or more career guidance like this let us know in the comment section so that we can also help you regarding these uh, yeah. things yeah okay. so bye bye see assalamu alaikum guys bye bye take care